In this video, I'm going to be showing you how you can record your WebEx meetings on your Mac. Hi, this is Josh from vMaker and let's get started. Here's the thing. If you're part of a WebEx meeting and the system administrator or the meeting host hasn't given you the permission to record the meeting, the easiest way around it is by using a third party app like vMaker to record it. Let me tell you what vMaker is. vMaker is an app that lets you record your screen, webcam and audio together. To start recording your meetings, the first thing that you'll have to do is install vMaker. To do that, open www.vmaker.com. Click on the sign up now button on the top right side of the website. You can choose to sign up using your Google account or your Facebook account or you can also sign up using your email ID. I'm going to be signing up using my Google account over here. Once you have successfully signed up, you will be taken to the vMaker dashboard where you can see the button to download vMaker for Mac. When you click on it, the DMG file for installation will be automatically downloaded. When the download is complete, click on the DMG file to initiate the installation process. Once the installation process is complete, you will be shown another window where you simply need to drag and drop vMaker into the application folder to complete the installation process as shown in this video. Once the installation is complete, click on Finder and click on the application folder. You will be able to see vMaker installed over here. Click on the vMaker icon to launch vMaker. When you launch vMaker, your Mac might ask you permission to open the app. Click on open to proceed. Once vMaker is open, select the screen recording option and start recording. Now that your screen is recording, all you have to do is join the WebEx meeting that you want to record. As the meeting goes on, it's being recorded by vMaker and you don't have to worry if the meeting gets really long because the best part is that there are no limitations to the recording duration on vMaker. When you want to stop recording the meeting, click on the red button on the left hand side of the screen. Once you stop recording, your video will be automatically uploaded to the vMaker cloud storage. You can also edit this video online on vMaker. You can share this video with others by using the copy link feature or downloading and storing it to your device. The best part about vMaker is that it's a free app and there are no limitations to your recording duration and there are no watermarks as well. So go ahead and start recording your meetings. I'll see you in the next video. Cheers.